Mario Kart 8. Can I tell you why? Um, I, I was busy this morning doing my civic duty. Been looking forward to it for a long time. Finally knocked it out. That's right. I finally tried the spicy chicken habanero McMuffin from McDonald's Canada. I know I've been talking about it for a long time. Everybody is like, well, how do you feel about it? I'm gonna I'm I'm here to finally say hey, I thought it was pretty good. I would give it a 3.5 out of 5. And um, I would say what I, what I said in chat, I feel like next time I would get a sausage McMuffin instead, probably. I don't go to McDonald's frequently for breakfast, so I, I gotta make it a special treat. I would definitely get the habanero chicken over an over an egg McMuffin though. No question about that. Also, I got my second dose, um, which is, is pretty sick. No symptoms except like 15 minutes after I got it, I had to pee so bad. But then I just like went to the bathroom and it went away. So we'll see. Uh, we'll see what happens after that. Okay, Yoshi Valley, hold on. It's, it's a soft lobby. It just got started. Not many sweat lords here yet. Just the diehard viewers. That gives me a chance. Fifth on Yoshi Valley, headed into the pass, we got the doubles. It's only lap one, why am I Why am I freaking out on lap one? Because it matters, man, because it matters. You save the mushroom, you use it for the ultra shortcut. It, you're a son of a bitch. You're a son of a bitch. I wanted to get the doubles, I only got the singles. That's okay, mushroom please, mushroom, triple mushroom. Oh, baby. Oh, that's not really like the line you want to be on coming out of it, but that's okay. Me and you, Alex. Thanks for the coins. <laughs> kind of. <laughs> yeah, I got my I got my second dose. I'm I'm now pleased that I can be a snob. What do I mean by that? Well, um, I was catching a lot of flack. Somebody should really let the public health authority of British Columbia know. But I was catching a lot of flack in a in a vod that I had. Where I said in BC they mix and match uh, some of the vaccines. So if you have the mRNA vaccine from either uh, Pfizer or Moderna, you could take the other one, or you could be assigned the other one as your second dose. Couple of couple of scientists in the YouTube comments were like, "That's not how vaccines work." Please don't explode on me. Um, I'm happy to report that it's a non-issue because. Uh, I got, I'm, I'm a pure Pfizer boy. I've exclusively got a Pfizer authored uh, genetic code operating uh, within my body right now. I'm taking the shortcut. They, I didn't even know this was, I, I thought this was not the critical path, by the way. I, I need some coins. The coins give you better top speed, but also they give you a, a speed bonus when you use them, when you pick them up, I should say. Beautiful, beautiful, thanks for the coins. Thanks for the coins, fifth place. Fifth place, get a double, get a single, and hope it's a mushroom. It's more than a mushroom. Don't, Alex, Alex. Alex, you fucking dickhead. I'm gonna get you. You skunk! You freaking skunk! Okay, well, you know what? Sixth place was still pretty good considering how hot that was. <laughs> oh, that, that was a hard fod sixth, man. That guy knocked me back to ninth. What a dude, come on. Sorry, that's the vaccine talking. That's the that's that's not me, it's the it's the I it's the rage from the vaccine. NL, did you see they were giving out free narcotics outside VPD as a method to combat combat the overdose epidemic? I did indeed. I did indeed see um, a, a viral screenshot of Counselor Gene Swanson holding a box that said in this box is cocaine warning it is a harmful and addictive substance vancouver you know it it always be trending i went by and I, I i just picked some up just to put in the in the wine cellar it's one of those it's like the u.s child tax credit right it's like if they're giving away stuff for free even if i don't want to use it i just I mean, if they're giving it away, it would be stupid not to grab it, right? It's just, don't mix it up with the baby powder. Baby powder? Are you crazy? 
That stuff's terrible for you. Haven't you been watching the news? There was a recall. You must have lost your damn mind. <laughs> good? Oh, uh, not good. Not good. Whatever, it's the first lap. Can I... Is this the first time I've done this course? Uh... In the Mario Kart streams? I know I've played it before, but... I feel like this is the first time I've played it for like a few days here. No, no, I, I did the thing I always do where I'm like, I'm gonna dodge to the left, and then I'm like, no, left isn't good, right's gonna work here, and then I dodge right back to the center. Turns out it frickin' sucks. Okay, just chill. Ninth place. All things considered could be worse. Hello, Sean. Hello, VIP Daniel. We're not really getting much of anything going here from, like, uh, I, I, I see you coming for me. There's nothing I can do about it, so why sweat? Alex! Alex went for uh, the non-streamer. Why? Why am I stupid? Okay. We gotta coin up. We gotta drive better. It's just that simple. You gotta coin up. You gotta drive a little better. Coins, please. You're okay. Maybe, maybe try doing some power slides at some point in your in your future. How is it possible to to get zero coins here? I'm actually I'm like using stars and falling behind. Okay, ninth place. I uh, the the other question that's going to be commonly asked, I'm sure. By the way, have you picked up a uh, a Steam Deck? No. I was uh, on my way home from the vaccine. I saw that Steam Deck pre-orders went live. I didn't even know that was the thing that they were doing. Uh, when I got home, I went to the website and it said, Sorry, there's so many people interested in this. We can't even load the page for you. And I said, That's alright. I got a PC. Brents, like, I just gotta know why, man. I just, I just gotta know, like, what, what's the reason? Just get out of the way of the bullet, man. Get, get the coins, not the red shells! Why? 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 It's not... It's not relevant! It's not relevant! <laughs> Tenth. <clears throat> did you see they're changing the Coke Zero recipe? I did see... Uh, that they're they're reducing or removing sorbitol and replacing it with aspartame. I could do 15 minutes on that if you want. Isn't isn't Coke with aspartame just diet Coke? I'm not, I've I've always been a, a I always thought it was a little strange that there was a Coke Zero and a diet Coke to begin with. Uh, and and I know that th this is not my opinion. This is my expectation for what the marketing is and the economics of it. I think that there are a, a group of people out there who think that Diet Coke is a drink for women and Coke Zero is like a drink that men can drink because it's got a cool black can that looks like nice and sleek. It's like an executive Uber or something. And the silver can is like, ooh, that's not for me. Come on. So maybe they're just unifying the recipe. Maybe they finally come to believe like what what I believed this whole time. Yo, Baby Park, I'm realizing, is really just a pure racing experience, huh? I, I've been looking, I've been looking down on Baby Park. I've been turning up my nose at it. I bet on us uh, getting. A mushroom there, and I, I'm ashamed of my words and my deeds. That's pretty good, though. I don't use Bear's strategy here. Mostly because I need to... ...figure out for myself how to how to drive better in this game. <laughs> Ninth is not a great start. I mean, you do like 25 laps of this, right? It's like a, a Formula One race. Beautiful, beautiful. Get you gotta get those coins though, man. Making great progress. Don't oh, come on, Shane. That's a dickhead move. <laughs> Who's shooting them backwards? Like we got hit by one that was going forwards as well. 
Who the hell is is on Baby Park shooting their their fireballs backwards? Like that's that's just ignorant, man. You ran into him? Excuse me. If you, uh, what about that one? Have you ever watched motorsport in your life? In motorsport, you maintain a line, even if you're if you're behind somebody, and they deviate from their line, to like nudge you. That's on them. That's 100% on the, on the Lewis Hamilton rather than on the Carlos Sainz. You skunk. <laughs> this is not motorsport. I suppose that's true. Mm-mm. <clears throat> Getting chased down, just getting hit with the star. It's sad, honestly. It's sad. Any wins today? Look, we're only two uh, two races deep. We're still warming up. This is, you know, even in F1, they don't just pop out there and go, uh, you know, hey, we're going to do our, our drive right now. They do a couple of free practices, and then they do qualifying, and then they do the actual race. Why don't you play a real racing game like F1? Because the only people who watch that, uh, who enjoy watching that kind of stuff on Twitch, are 65-year-old Europeans. And most of them, some of them have moved to North America and exist in a similar time zone. Most of them, though, live in Europe and are on a, a much different time zone than me. They're, they're asleep right now, getting ready for... Uh, Getting ready for a cool European Saturday right now. Okay, good, good. You, you can't go through a crab. That's just, that's audacity, that's ambition, and it's foolhardy. Excuse me, it's 9 p.m. Uh, not in, um, not on, not on the Sakhalin Islands. Probably like freaking 1 a.m. over there, which is where a large chunk of my viewers come from. Is is the Sakhalin Islands? That's not a ligma, by the way. It's a real place. So is ligma, but you know you're not ready for that one. I know what you're gonna say. Did did you steer to try to hit Andy with the blue shell for no reason? Half right. You're half right. I steered to try to hit Andy, but it was not for no reason. It was because I was pissed off. Nice star. It must be cool to be like in almost last place and get a good item. I got a red shell on the other hand. Oh, never mind. I got a star. <laughs> Screwed. Good, good use of the star. Hey, hey. Okay, where are we at? Six. Oh, you. That was totally my fault. <laughs> I saw the bullet coming, okay. Endless mushrooms, four coins is not where you want to be. Golden mushroom on a corner, yeah, just, just drive. I didn't even know you could drive off of this course, quite frankly. But in 12th, this is where you get, uh, you get all the best items. Look at that. Um, the bullet? Bounced off a wall? Oh, that's just... That's ignorant, again. I don't think I need to tell you how ignorant this is. Just just playing pinball, man. Tenth place again. <laughs> oh, this is disastrous. <clears throat> First four matches, all... All just warm-ups. All warm-ups. You can still power slide when the shroom is activated. Yeah, but it's like it's so many buttons to hit. You gotta mash ZL. I had to look up what the, the name of the button even is. Then you gotta go into the turn, hit R, and then keep going like... You gotta keep wiggling the stick like this. Oh my, it's, it's... Keep in mind that in my real life, my car drives itself. And as a result, this is all very foreign to me. I use a, a fly-by-wire, um, Boeing 
727. It was recently decommissioned from SAS, the uh, the the Danish Aviation Corporation. It's it's a really fast car, but it's hard as hell to park. Like finding a parking spot for that is like it's a disaster, man. Hey, Spectre, thanks for the gifted subs. Thank you. <laughs> is automatic gearbox that prevalent in Canada and the US, or is it NL bias? If I had to estimate, I would say my, my prediction is that 87% of vehicles sold in North America are automatic transmissions. That's my guess. I don't read the public the publications. Manuals are there there's a few different subsets. If you're getting a high performance like sports car and you love driving, you're probably going to get a manual. Um there's some people who uh, I, I feel like if you buy a sedan, you're going to get an automatic, but if you get the hatchback, 100% you're going manuals. I sometimes I remember like when you drive in downtown Seattle when you'd see people with a manual you're just like careful he's a hero. Yeah, it's it's very uncommon. Well, not very uncommon. Um it's you you see 20 to 1 automatic to manual transmissions in my opinion. So so like what are we doing here by the way? <laughs> oh, there we go. Thanks thanks for the vote. No idea, just hanging out, just hanging out. I'll give it my best shot. Oh, communication error has occurred. It's fine, I will join, uh, this is my tournament, it's called Bremp. I will join Bremp. I will be Luigi. Someone said use the, the, the streetle. It plays well with your play style, so I'm willing to give it a chance. You're spectating, get ready. How do you disengage the engine on an auto? I'm gonna be straight up with you, I don't know what that means. Disengage the engine? It's put it in neutral. Oh, well, yeah, okay, with an automatic transmission, you still have a gear selector. You just don't select, um, like, you know, one, two, three, four, five. You have park, which is, you know, nothing works. You got neutral, which is your car is on, but, uh, the, uh, you know, you, you can rev it, but you don't actually get any thrust. That's also known as, uh, the car wash gear select because anytime you go through an automatic car wash they want you to have that on and then there is drive and of course reverse which you would be familiar with i you know try not to use that one too much but yeah and then sometimes there's like a like a sport mode and you're like you, you don't you only notice like halfway through driving that you're that your car is in sport mode and you're like what the hell am i doing by the way this is where we this is where we got our dub. I'm just, I'm not saying this is my track, because honestly, I think the first few times I drove it, I was insanely bad at it. But it is the only track in Mario Kart history where I've ever gotten a win. By the way, this thing drives smooth as frickin' silk, man. Whoever told me to use the, the little bitty buggy? Look at this thing. It drives like a... Looks like a steakhouse, but it handles like a bistro. Ooh, sorry. <laughs> See, now it, it turned me into a scumbag. Whoops. Uh, whoops. Uh, I'm just gonna sneak right by you. Would you ever go back to Track Mania? Yeah, it would. Um, I mean, my my knock on Track Mania is not Track. Please, is not Trackmania's fault. 
It's actually just because I have, like, uh, an increasingly bad inner ear the older I get. The, the Battle Royale mode just, like, made me nauseous. Like, the first time that we played the Battle Royale mode, I was like, maybe it was just, like, I had too much coffee that day, or it was too hot, or I slept bad, or something like that. Then when I played it with Dan, I was like, nah, this makes me want to throw up for some reason. You cannot hurt me. I have stolen your banana peel. And then used it for no reason. Oh, that's, that's good. Just a bunch of stars and bullet bills. That's cool. I got a ghost that gave me a banana peel. Never mind. I got a star. I'm going to stop complaining now. I wasted it completely. And now I am off the edge. I have died in Bowser's castle. Path of Exile's doing BR now. Dude, I, have I ever told you that Path of Exile was like my, uh... <laughs> come on, man. <laughs> Shit rolls downhill. Path of Exile is like my game that got away. I, I, <laughs> I saw... <laughs> I saw, um... Quill tweet about... He, he did like a flex that was like, check it out. In, uh... 2012, I emailed the Path of Exile team. Just to be like, hey, can I play your game? So he, he was trying to flex that he's a little bit of an OG. Well. Um, which is fair. I also emailed the Path of Exile team in 2012 and said, yo, I love Diablo 2. Can I play your game early? And they said, sure, check it out. And then I uh, played it for about an hour and I said, this shit is never going to work. <laughs> this is never going to take off. What a disaster. It's, uh, it's too complicated. Uh, I'm just... Diablo 3 is gonna blow this out of the water. And little did I know that I was very much on the wrong side of history there. My... It just goes to show you, you know, your, your judgment might be good in some domains, but, uh, is also, uh, you know, it's not infallible. Beep, beep, boop. Beep, beep, boop. <clears throat> you gotta be careful, you know. Everybody's... Nobody's good at everything, but everybody's good at something. Remember that old Canadian PSA? Oh, this map. This map is, is disastrous. Don't bite me! <laughs> you had to bite Lewis! Lewis was in front of me! Don't bite me! Okay, focus on the drive here. Nobody else is bantering. That gives them a distinct advantage. Look, I mean, I want to be mad, but how am I going to be mad? Like, when I'm in 11th and somebody hits me with a green shell backwards, I'm like, F you. When I'm in 10th and somebody hits me with a green shell from behind, I'm like, okay, F you too. Just stop hitting me. I never thought the piranha would eat my face. I, I do feel like I'm being bumped a little bit. But I guess, you know, rubbing is race. Days of Thunder, baby. Two coins is not going to work long term. Might I suggest upping our coin game? Thank you for not biting me. Yeah, like maybe those coins in the middle. Yes! Worth? Worth? Don't, yeah, good. You picked a side. This is, this is better. We, we've made a little progress. We have to use these. We gotta get ready for our next items. Bro, how many Rosalinas are in here? It's getting ridiculous. We've made it to third place. NL gets so into it. I'm, I'm fighting for my life. A, li a little rude. I mean, I did just spawn. I don't know what happened to us on the on the ramp there. But you can tell there's there's a little bit of improved driving. It's it's tough because I think that my competitors are also improving at a similar rate. But I feel like I'm I'm improving my driving a touch. Maybe not a ton. Can somebody explain the Coriolis effect to me on that one? That's gonna hit me. Never mind, I'm great. <laughs> 
Can you drive a manual transmission? Absolutely not. No. I I understand the philosophy. I have never done it. You're in a gear. Your car starts going ree 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 and that's where you got to Oops. <laughs> Fifth place, baby. That's when it when you hit the red line, you step on the clutch and go tink and then that's that's what you do, right? And then you spend all day posting on like car enthusiast subreddits about how like look at this guy. I bet he doesn't even know how to drive a manual. Hold on. Let me let me say hello to my wife and baby. Oh no. No. I will say with respect to like manual transmissions, I have done the um I've done the thing where like in a racing game, I'm like maybe this year I'm going to learn how to use manual transmissions. And then I try to uh you know, drive them for about 5 minutes and I go, "Ah, eh, this is like entertainment time. I'm supposed to be having fun right now." I think it could be fun to drive a, a stick shift. But, I mean, it's all... You know what else is fun? Like, driving um, an automatic transmission car and then just getting your entertainment from, like, you know, listening to music or, like, a podcast or something instead of going, like... Ba -dunk -dunk. I mean, I, I think, like, a, I'm not saying one's better, one's worse. One's definitely easier, and that's kind of, like, I'm all about that. I also occasionally drive on some roads with, um, with big hills. Thus providing a, a little bit of extra impetus, honestly, not to drive manual. Is it, like, what's the, what's the bonus with manual? It's, like, more... Fuel efficient if you if you're good at it. You know, I'm I'm not confident that I would be good at it. <laughs> not even anymore. The the automatics are better now. Oh, okay. No bonus, you just show off. Okay. I mean I I understand that. I, I can get down with that, I suppose. I already show off when I when I drive my Boeing. 727 decommissioned uh, SAS uh, airliner to the Costco and, and land it on the roof. So I, I don't know if I need the, the extra show-off factor, but look at this. This is how you, you play a, a good, clean game. You keep a green shell to protect yourself, and then somebody drove into me. You can't even make that up. Like, why are you so obsessed with me? Mushrooms, please. That's three green shells, which is... is fine. We gotta try, though. We gotta try to send one at you. If it hits me, it hits me. That's... Oh! Mushrooms, please. Okay. Fuck you. <laughs> Third place, though, that's pretty good. Look, you might say, isn't it BM to send the uh, to send the red shell backwards as you cross the finish line? Yeah, you know what else is BM? Uh, sending like 17 green shells at me when I was just trying to get into second place. I know that's the game, but you know what else is the game? Sending the red shell backwards when you're about to cross the finish line. Why are you dress like you're about to do a presentation? I like the top button up, man. You gotta understand that when you're bald, you gotta do some different things, like, fashion-wise. I think if you look like Colonel Sanders' son, it's actually advantageous for you. Because you look like you might be, like, an app designer. 
or something like that. And then you get the hat and you, you, you don't wear it like down, you wear the hat like low, but then you put the brim like way up. And then maybe if you put on like a bow tie and then like dark brown short shorts uh, and bowling shoes. And then this is the look, man. The summer season designed by Stefan Urkel. So fresh and so clean. Sorry, I had to wait for a comment to come in that I resonated with. I like the top button all the way up, quite frankly. Hey, spinning machine. Thanks for the gifties. Thank you. I've never, uh, to the best of my knowledge... Oh, if, if you'll excuse me, I'm running out of disk space on this PC. Manage storage to view usage and free up some space. So that's literally covering, like, my entire screen right now. It's alright. You know what it is? Like, I'm not actually low on storage, but, like, my SSD is probably down to, like, a few gigabytes. Every time I open Photoshop, it's like, scratch disk full! And I'm like, what are you talking about? You got, like, nine gigs to work with there, and it's like, I can't! It kills! <laughs> The chin kills! Yo, I should have been playing this not on my preview monitor. Look at... It's so like... Uh, it's like 90 FPS on the Switch, man. I feel so much better. Go ahead. Go ahead, Mr. Star. I know I got gotcha. you. I know I got... Oh, you... There's so much freaking data on me, I can't read. I just wanted the mushroom. Yeah, the memory on those programs is crazy, man. I mean, come on, Adobe, what am I paying you? Uh, I, I probably paid you like eight grand over my lifetime using Photoshop. You can't work on the virtual memory a little? I mean, you swerved into me in my, in my world there. Beautiful. Beautiful performance and then the mushroom Again, the, the boomerang, was that a boomerang backwards? That, I, I think it was a boomerang back, or it was on its way back, one of the two. Okay, uh, try getting some coins. Look at that, I mean, it just, it, it really says something, wouldn't you say? I can t you can see when they're using their rear view mirror as well. Tells you everything you need to know. This guy's driving 100% in his rear view. Why are you so obsessed with me? It's okay, we're gonna get more mushrooms. We're gonna get more mushrooms right here. Even better. Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> How did we start going backwards? We were so close to Wolf in the last race too. That, that hurts. Okay, just close close Photoshop. Let, let's see how the, the disk space changes when you close Photoshop. Nine gigabytes. Went, went from like 50 megabytes. Nine gigabytes. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> Why do you have Photoshop open in the background? It's a conscious thing I do all the time. Um, I always open it before the stream. It's definitely not a situation where I have it open because I'm, you know, putting the thumbnails up until like 11 p.m. And then I'm like, oh, I got to go to bed immediately, wake up, go to my vaccine appointment, eat a habanero chicken sandwich uh, from McDonald's, give it a 3.5 out of 5, do my civic duty, go live immediately playing Mario Kart, and then... You know, just have it open. Bros, don't even talk to me, man. I bet you have, like, if I looked at your Google Chrome, over under on the tabs, the Cosmo Sportsbook in Las Vegas, Nevada, sunny Las Vegas, Nevada, I'm thinking you got nine tabs open. My Annie list, 100%, probably like three or four tabs there. Twitch.tv slash Northern Lion. Twitch.tv slash Northern Lion slash buy gifted subscriptions. Twitch.tv slash 
Northern Lion slash follow. 28 tabs? What the hell? Is that allowed? 50 or 60 tabs? I thought every tab was like a gig of RAM. You got 60 tabs open? Stack Overflow doesn't count. If you got 100 tabs open and 95 of them are Stack Overflow, you only have 5 tabs open. Okay, Zelda map. Here we go. This was the DLC map, right? Where you get rupees instead of uh, instead of coins. Wow, what a what a world. No tabs. I'm watching through terminal. Mm, so true, fellow. Good sir. Upvotes to the left. Kids these days have no idea how to use Vim. Vim. I'm an Emacs guy personally. I, yes, okay. I'm very familiar with the with the memes and the and the so ons and the. Imagine using your mouse when you program. <laughs> Couldn't be me. Oh, hello. Uh, that very much depends on what the trying one thing is. Mm, yeah. I understand. I don't understand. <laughs> Hello, honey. Um, that, yeah, Dada. I don't understand what's what's going on in here. I mean, the, bringing the baby into the office has been one thing. Wheeling the high chair into the office when we have like you know eight other rooms where you could feed the baby is uh, maybe starting to approach the what I would describe as non-tenable. On the other hand, the distracted driver is helping me. Well, never mind. No, that seems more, that seems more apt. How big is the house? It's, it's, 35 square feet. I spend most of our liquid on the uh, decommissioned Boeing 727. I thought the av really was bullish on the aviation sector heading into 2020. Turns out it fucking sucked. It was a very bad idea. Backwards shell in 10th place. Hey, you live by the sword, you die by the sword. Seven twenty-seven has very bad fuel economy. No, it's okay because I I shift manually. I I drive the manual transmission seven twenty-seven and it, it helps me out. Oh, good. Uh, for a second, I thought we were going to end up on the sub coaster. Luckily, we got on random and then we got to go to the sub coaster. Can you imagine shifting gears on an airliner? Doesn't that happen? Like, sometimes w when I was very flight anxious, the f when I first started flying, as a consumer, not as a pilot, obviously, um, you know, you, they, they start you in, like, super gear when you take off. It goes, weep, and then after that, you stay, like, pretty much full throttle, almost until you reach cruising altitude. Then on cruising altitude, like... They cut the power when they reach. I mean, you can tell I played a little bit of flight sim in my day, right? This is the exact terminology they use when they're flying. They're always like, hey, we're, we're up real high. Cut the power. One second. I got to own this. <laughs> what was that? Oh, no. 
That was always like the scariest part of the flight for me when they when they cut the power. All the lights go off and the oxygen masks come out of the ceiling and you're like, whoa, is this normal? And they're like, shut up and just keep watching Meet the Fockers. This is a heck of a race, huh? Don't, don't, Andy. There's no need. It. <laughs> I can get in. Uh, I, I could do it this weekend for sure. You, usually, if she fusses like that, I just, uh, I just give her the the cold shoulder for a minute. Like I'm like, if she wants to fuss, she doesn't want to eat. I'm like, fine, just sit in your high chair for like five minutes. Then she comes around. Sean, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna hit you with this, Sean. Told you. Please. That hurts. I wish I had my red shell back. Abusing iframes? Oh, you son of a... <laughs> From first to eighth. That, that hurt. That was painful for me. You know what though? Decent race. Sixth place. You replay yourself. He's smiling. Uh, Honey, you have to eat. Uh, I also, I, I let her hold the, the pouch when possible. You, you gotta, yeah, you kinda gotta set it in her hands. She won't grab it. Yeah, she's saying, mmm. She's like, I love the food. Mmm. Mm. Mm. No, Ribbon Road. Yes! Okay. Now this is a course. 47 points. Sean has 78. Sean, why you look like the main character from Death Note, man? Sending green shells backwards in, like, ninth place? What's, what's the main character in Death Note? L? Why you look like Light shooting green shells backwards? Come on, man. Oh, shit. L showed up with the Mario Kart game. Oh, <laughs> Does this thing ever stop spinning? Beautiful, beautiful turn. Yep, that was uh, not the best use of uh, either driving or an item. Dunk, dunk, dunk. I know there's a ribbon road shortcut. Like, when you're public enemy number one, you got people bumping into you 99% of your driving time. It's a bit, it's a bit of a spicy one. <laughs> what? Yeah, she's driving Mar Mario Kart in real life, trying to just get the high chair out of here. You tricked me into thinking the Joker thing was popular when it's not? What are you talking about? I feel like we prefaced it by saying, I, I found it in the replies of a random video on Twitter. It wasn't like I was walking down the street, there was a bus ad for Joker at the baseball game. I mean, in, in my perfect world, yes, but... It had 120 views? That's because it's a re-upload of the TikTok. No. I was, I was just about to win. <laughs> Cool, cool. That should only take a second to fix. Paid online, by the way. Um, I'm gonna join up on this one. That was the one, dude! <clears throat> Who pulled the ethernet cord out? Yeah, Sean! Was that you, Light? Don't lie to me, Light. I don't know, Light. 
Your notes been looking pretty deathy lately. Don't write my name in your book, L. You sassy baka. I know all about Death Note, man. He's got like a haunted mole skin or something, right? Sure. Yeah, yeah. Okay, we only have three people. You got it backwards, but close enough. One of them is just like a dude that looks like this, right? And then the other one is like, he looks like Indie Mouse's Twitter avatar. And is like 18 feet tall or something. Yes, that's correct. Okay. See, I, I'm, I'm very familiar with the... With Japanese animation. I'm gonna watch my first anime when, when Marvel's What If comes out. You, you should all be very happy. Okay, that side is not a shortcut. It lies to you. It's a long cut. Beautiful, beautiful. Now, this, this is just a leisurely drive, man. Whoops. <laughs> just a nice leisurely drive, bumping into some stuff now and then. Look at this. You get, you get a little coin, uh, a little speed boost every time you get a coin. I didn't know I could bump into you. That's great intel. Even at full coins, a, a coin still gives you a speed boost. This win, by the way, does not count as a real win, but... I was, this is a bad time to glance. I apologize. We got a me right behind us. It's just so relaxing. <laughs> it's such a relaxing game of Mario Kart, man. Look at, we're still getting coins, we're threading the needle on the bats. Music's different in first place, this is a dream come true, dude. Oh, now, don't you hate it, it's like that Kanye tweet about babysitting the water bottle. Don't you hate it when you get a, a green shell and then you gotta babysit this green shell the whole time for the rest of the flight? Luckily that ended up not being too relevant. It worked. Oh my god. Boost, please. Thank you. Hit him again. Let's go. Yo, the song is so good. <laughs> Look at, see, when I got nobody else, like, gumming up the gears, man, I can drive like a, like a son of a gun. Look at it. You can just call me Dick Trickle. What? Dick Trickle. Dick Trickle. One of the most decorated NASCAR drivers of all time. Dick, Tr Dick Trickle. Am I insane or did somebody just leave the game? No, no, they were just, they disappeared. That was a great driver, man. <laughs> or a great drive, I should say. I will say, when I made the tweet, um, do you got... Do you want a receipt? Gotta be about the dumbest question I get asked. Somebody replied with a NASCAR avatar that I recognized and said, you've evolved into a bitter old man. And then I almost reply. I, I workshopped it in my head for like 40 minutes. I was, I was trying to think of the best uh, NASCAR driver to reference with the soft block message. Uh, and I was going to say, whatever you say, Danny Hamlin, block, unblock, mute. But instead, I was like, I recognize your avatar. I think you're making a joke. But in my head, I was like, Denny Hamlin is the best one. Denny Hamlin is just like, because it recognizes that I know a thing or two about the next tell sprint for the cup. It's an Isaac me, dude. <laughs> it is an Isaac me. Like, I wasn't going, hey, Jeff Gordon, Jimmy Johnson, Tony Stewart, Dale Earnhardt Jr. I hit you with the Denny Hamlin. Oh, a uh, communication error is about to occur. It hasn't been Nextel in 25 years. That's, I mean, I honestly, I couldn't even tell you what the hell Nextel is. Is that company even still around? It's about to crash again, man.
Sprint bot Nextel. Nextel, what does that mean? It got sponked. Is that the new term for mergers and acquisitions? I mean, I won and then this happened. So it tells you every. I, I got way more time with the crown than the average person. Look at that. Saved. What's the Marvel What If you're most excited for? I thought I came up with a good one yesterday, which is... Oh, we're lagged out again. Everyone's just looking, waiting for me to pick a map. Oh, my social anxiety. Um, what, what if Loki and Thor kissed on the Bifrost? I thought that would be a good one. They're brothers? Um, spoilers. <laughs> Not by blood. Thor is Asgardian, and Loki is a frost giant from Jotunheim. Spoilers for the movie from 2011. Yeah, they were just roommates, like Abraham Lincoln, and then that guy that Abraham Lincoln lived with for uh, 20 years when he was the Attorney General of uh, Illinois. Like Franklin Pierce, he's just a lifelong bachelor who happened to be elected to the president and very much enjoyed the company of his male friends. Come on, man. Start me up here. Start me up. Come on, man. Come on. Any second. Any second now. There we... Dude, not so bad. I did not listen to a podcast. I just know Franklin Pierce because for some reason I'm like bizarrely interested in the historical American presidents. I'm out for dead presidents to represent me. Including Franklin Pierce. Two mushrooms? I guess I am in second place. Like, I, I gotta stop being indignant when we get bad items when it's because we're in a good position. Good song. It is, you know... What's that? The World is Yours by Nas? It's one of those Nas songs, for sure. I never got that line when he was like, I'm out for dead presidents to represent me. I'm like, they already did represent you, Nas. When they were serving... Just never understood the line. I can't be mad about a, a red shell there. Come on, Nas. <laughs> If you were out for dead presidents to represent you, you should have given them some credit when they were alive. Hello? Do you see those shots? Like, we're getting dangerously close to being the greatest Mario Kart driver of all time. Oops. Gotcha. Thanks for the mushroom. Stinky. Oh, no, no. Come on. Uh, uh, how do you get a bullet in, in the second place? That's a war crime. He's not making it, man. Okay, he totally made it. Watch. Oh, you nice. Make sure you get these. Is a 10% speed boost for every coin you get. Up to 10, and then you get an infinitesimal speed gain. You stole my mushroom? I used one after the ghost appeared. I'm, I'm pretty pogged about that. Look at that BM banana. We need mushrooms? That's good. I don't know if it was good, but it wasn't that bad. <gasps> <laughs> I think if I didn't go for the, the hit, I might have come third instead of fourth, but it felt good. <laughs> it was a good race, though. I had a good time on that one. Uh, we're going to run some ads. We're still going to place uh, another hour of, uh, of Mario Kart 8 here. If you uh, don't want to see the ads, you know how it goes. You can use your Andy Jassy bucks. That's the new CEO of... Uh, of Amazon, you can use your Andy Jassy bucks to use your Twitch Prime subscription, or you can use uh, hard-earned American dollars, your Jerome Powell.